from bone dry to this today. Look at that poor lady trying to get through the hail. This was captured by Andra Litton, who lives on the east side, and you can see that it was about the size of a quarter. Some of those chunks probably damaged some cars out there with that severe thunderstorm that cropped up at about 6.30 this evening until 7 o'clock before clearing the county. Now it's beautiful. Isn't it, doesn't it feel good after a little rain in the area? 75 degrees at the airport right now. Winds are east at 10 miles per hour. Take a look at that dew point. You could feel it coming in last night. Dew point at 56. Our normal dew point this time of year is between 15 and 20. And look at these dew points and notice the difference to the west. We're still at 56, 57 Juarez, 52 Las Cruces, and of course that's a good measure of the mugginess or the humidity, the fuel for the thunderstorms. Out toward Deming, it's only 25. Well, the winds reverse tomorrow, so we're going to have some change in the forecast for our Friday. We'll see storms well to the east of El Paso County tomorrow. Here were the high temperatures today. We were 93, normal is 95 for El Paso, 95 Las Cruces, 94 Juarez, and 90 in Alamogordo today. Rain-wise, only officially 0.12 in the rain gauge at the airport, much more east of there, over an inch along Montana, especially out in East Montana. We still have one active storm, a cluster moving down through the Sacramento Mountains of New Mexico. A severe thunderstorm warning has just expired just to the south of Timberone, but you can see that cell that was producing 60 mile per hour winds and quarter size hail. We had that storm over El Paso, so we've stabilized, but that doesn't mean the winds are done with us for tonight. As storms break apart, they fall apart, and the winds go in all directions. So even west siders, where we got nothing today, we're likely to get some gusty winds through the night. Here are the winds right now, 18 miles per hour airport, 13 Las Cruces, 29 miles per hour at the pass. We've got a low-pressure system right over southern Canada. We'll see a wide swath of thunderstorms that includes eastern New Mexico, most of Texas, tomorrow. Drier air will move into the borderland from the southwest, so that's going to move all the storms east of El Paso County. Here are the temperatures right now. 70 Alamogordo, 81 Deming, and 75 in what is your low temperatures tonight? 63 Alamogordo, 60 Deming, 66 Juarez, and 64 for Van Horn. High temperatures tomorrow, 94 Alamogordo, 96 for Deming, 98 Juarez, and 95 Van Horn. Tonight, 65 low temperature at the airport. I think we're done with the storms tonight, but still occasional gusts, and now you know why. 97 high temperature for tomorrow with a partly cloudy skies, but will be storm free. Look to the east to see some distant lightning tomorrow evening. Only KTSM gives you nine full days of weather. Sunshine 99 on Saturday. Really a beautiful day, but hot. 100 on Sunday. It begins the triple digit trend again. 101 on Monday. 102 Tuesday. 105 potentially on Wednesday before those isolated storms return Thursday and Friday. If you see a beautiful storm, take a picture of it and be a weather watcher. Send it to news at KTSM.com, sponsored by Gonzalez Heating and Cooling. We'll be right back with more news in just a moment.